So I am decorating my house at the moment. I originally did it because I was like, oh, if I'm gonna be stuck in for a hot minute on this lockdown, might as well make my surroundings a bit cuter. But it's like a nice little accent that's come from it. A happy accent, is that what it's called? Is that dirty? It sounds, it sounds kind of dirty. But a nice happy accent that's come from it is that it's made me feel really good in myself, like doing these jobs that like, I put off for so long because I was gonna wait for like a guy to come over and do it, like my dad or a builder or whatever that obviously they can't come over now because of this lockdown and I'm like I've done them myself and I feel super empowered because obviously they're like stereotypically masculine jobs and it's like girl are we still doing this it's 2020 can we like you know and it's just I think a lot of us are in prisons that we don't even realize we're in because that like a gendered stereotype and it's just so deeply ingrained in our like psyche um and this needs to change and talking of change uh, a little bit of serendipity here but while I was decorating Valspa reached out to me madness and have asked me to work with them on a campaign they're doing off the back of International Women's Day, where they are basically renaming some of their pink paint names. Because, uh, you know, pink painting pink paint names can be kind of wild in terms of like uh not being that progressive in terms of stereotypes around gender. Like they'll be called things like, I don't know, like princess vagina lady sprinkle and it's like really do we have to call paint that so, Valspar have basically sent me some of their pink paint chips with names that are you know not that 2020 in terms of stereotypes around girls and women and are gonna ch actually change the names which i think is amazing i commend them for this um so here we go we have shy girl we have Zainty Delights, don't watch my painty fingers. We have Faint of Heart and we have Zoe Face. 